All right, let's go over this God's book real quick. This dude right here you see is a new dude. He's the avatar for the powers to be. 10 years ago, skipping past a lot of shit, his ass went to this bathroom with this dude right here, right? To go fight this damn demon, Damon or whatever the fuck you want to call it. Bro right here literally has like a damn near a demon Pokédex and shit that tell you everything about the damn demon. Plus the weaknesses and how to kill him. Later, he ended up going to lunch or some shit with this girl right here who is his wife. And they got a divorce because she's part of the natural order of things and he's part, he's the avatar of the powers of be. They can't be together. So she popped his ass in the eye. That's why now we see his ass looking like this with his eye like that. They go to Dr. C uh, Strange Crib meet up with Juan to go to the Library of Worlds to meet up with all the rest of the you pause to see everybody there. They was talking about this Babylon event that's gonna happen. This dude named Corbus Core came to this place right here and he stole the staff of the Living Tribunal. And dude is in this place up there that you see trying to bring basically Cthulhu and them motherfuckers to the real world. Now the staff real power is the user and the staff can write a spell and rewrite reality in the con uh, continue leaving no room for a counter spell. So why they went off to go fucking uh, fight the motherfuckers, right? The, the avatar for the powers of be, he found this penny. And like I said, they went to go fight the dude ass to stop the Babylon event. Bro takes the penny to the collector. The collector says it's from a lost fucking extinct world or universe or some shit, and he wants it. And he changed, he exchanged, trades that fucking penny for this book and a clock. That clock got six hands. He takes that clock to this dude, which in turn give him this this uh, this vase with a whole bunch of rare ass precious gifts in the world. He takes he breaks that motherfucker and there was a key in there and he takes it to this girl who gives him this damn like teleporter thing that can take him to the place where he's needed to be. They was finna talk about the book, but he shut dude Pokédex thing up as you can see right here. While they was getting fucked up by dude as the natural they he was fucking up the natural order of things. Them people it's like twenty five of them. Bro went to go meet up with Doctor Strange and he used that teleporter thing to go help out in the fight. So he helping out in the fight and shit, right? That's when his ass dropped the book. Dude was like, no, not the book. Dude was like, oh, knowledge that I need to know about. Let me see what's going on in this book. He gets to reading the book and the book fucks him up. And then dude beats his ass. Later and shit where he's talking to Dr. Strange, we found out what the book can do. The longer you read it, the more it eats your mind. And once you start, you can't break free. Someone else has to stop you. His girl came back and they kissed and she thanked him for saving him. And that was the end of that shit. In the next book, basically, we find we're going to learn more about the Sensum and about this hidden door and the hidden library that hides a hidden door.